Who is it going to be? Who's going to be the first winner of the official TOTM Spa, Winner Spa Day? Okay, we're going to get it all. Okay. Can I get a drum roll? Raving about author Valerie Carey's book, TOTM, Time of the Month, the essential calendar planner for girls and women of all ages. Customers have described it as the most complete planner any female in her menstrual flowing years will ever need. says it's the sick joke that God plays on women every month or maybe you've used the following phrases the curse PMS TOTM my favorite I am woman hear me roar so I'm sure by now you know that I'm talking about the menstrual cycle well my next guest is Valerie Carey author of the book time of the month the essential calendar planner for girls and women of all ages. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. I gotta tell you, the first thing I thought of when I saw this TOTM time of the month, my daughter Samantha. She's nine, and I'm gonna, you know, have to, I'm gonna have to start talking to her about this situation because it's gonna happen soon. And I'm not in, I'm not, a, I'm not thrilled. I totally. Can understand. you tell? Yes. No. It's <laughs> a hard topic to talk about. It is. It is, and I totally understand because when I had my daughter Shelby, I was very concerned about how am I going to speak to her about it. So she's really the reason why I wrote the book, TOTM, Time of the Month. And how old is she now? She's 15. Oh, so she already knows and understands yes, the situation, if does. you will. So, you know, I've been to the bookstore, and I'll look at some books, and I'll think to myself, okay, maybe I can get that one. There are a lot of books, Valerie, to be honest, to talk about this topic. Yours is somewhat different. Let's talk about that. Well, Chrissy, it's actually a hybrid book, Calendar Planner, so I give tips on different things that you can do to prevent bloating, cramping, and things of that nature, but you can also utilize the book as a Calendar Planner, where you're documenting your weekly, your daily, monthly appointments, and there are specific pages designed 
just for tracking that time of the month. Your cravings, your pains, your mood swings, uh, your skin conditions, and remedies that you use to um, deal with the pains. And it's very specific because when you talk about mood, you have sad, happy, depressed. When you talk about pains, and here's mine, bloating. So you're very specific in terms of how the person is feeling at the time. Yes, and bloating is a common uh, symptom that women experience during that time of the month. Now something I do want our viewers to know is that this is really not a, a book just for you know, like a teenager. This is a book for women of all ages. Yes, it's for women of all ages in their cycling years. So it can range from eight years old into your 60s. And even for a woman like me that's knocking on the door to, you know, menopause. Heart, <laughs> you are not knocking at the door. But it's not a bad idea, right? <laughs> no, it's not a bad idea for women who are in their menopausal stage. Something that I loved about this, and I'm going to be very honest, when when obviously I, I got my menstrual cycle, I, I really wasn't very open with my mom. At the time, it really wasn't a conversation you would have with your mom. I like how if a child is able to document her feelings, it could open the lines of communication between mom and daughter. Exactly. It can open the line of communication between mothers and daughters, single dads and their daughters, and even women when they speak to their gynecologist. It's a great communication tool. I mean, one of the first things that's asked of us women when we go to the gynecologist or even a dentist is when was your last menstrual cycle? And then you have to start thinking. Yes. Okay, wait two weeks ago and you start, you could have it right here? Exactly. Right Easy peasy. It. Exactly. Let's talk about something that I love also. You give great little tips on what to do with those symptoms. And okay. of course mine, I already was very honest, is bloating. So I found your remedy for bloating. Tell my viewers, I love it. Bananas? Bananas, I, I get so excited about bananas. Bananas, I call them my triple threat to PMS because they're great for bloating, they're great for cramping, and they help boost your mood. And so a great way to eat them is if you dip them in some chocolate and you throw them in a the freezer, it makes a great treat. I've gotta start doing that. And you say here, they make a great frozen treat that will bring a smile to your face and even bring you that so happy state. I yes. love that. So tell me also about these stickers. This is something I think really you could do with your daughter and have kind of like fun with it. You have these stickers that talk about mood. Yes, um, there's a little girl in every woman I feel and so stickers are awesome. I think we all love them. And this is a fun way to say I'm feeling cranky or irritable or grouchy oh, on any fine. particular day. I'm feeling grouchy. Normally, in about two weeks, I'll be putting that <laughs> sticker here. You know, let me tell you, when the time comes, and it's coming, that I talk to my daughter about these things, I am definitely going to put this to the test in music because I have a feeling it's going to help me communicate with her yes. and her communicate with, with me, you. which is awesome. Yes, it is. Thank you, Valerie. Thank you so much. Christy. I really appreciate your time. And if you want to read Time of the Month, go to the website, totmtimeofthemonth.com.